Chelsea drew 2-2 with Burnley. Newcastle, they won 4-3 against West Ham. Want to hear from West Ham fans. Sheffield United as well. <laughs> one minute they were 4-1 up, it looked like. And then they drew the game 3-3 with Fulham. Shambles from them. Nottingham Forest 1-1 with Crystal Palace. Bournemouth 1-2-1 against Everton. And Tottenham dug a result out against Luton Town, winning 2-1. You can have your say on all of them performances. Let's go to Steve. He's a West Ham fan. All right, Steve? Good evening, Steve. Hello, mate. Yeah, not bad. Are you guys all right? I'm all right, I'm all right Steve. I'm all right. I oh, mean, three one. Your head must be rolling oh. after that today. Honestly, I cannot believe it. I mean, where do we start? I mean, <laughs> first the first penalty. I mean, Gordon's coming back from an offside position, so mm. you know. Um, mm-hmm. And then we've got the David Moyes decision on taking Antonio off. Yeah, we'll start with look. Start with that one before we go yeah. to the penalty yeah. decisions. Baffling, you know. Uh, look, Gabby yeah. watched the game. He's and you know he's telling me about it, and I've seen the highlights. And yeah, what was he doing taking Antonio Should, off? He's running him around. Yeah. Uh, absolutely, I really do not know. I mean, 69th minute. Mm. I mean. That, that there's still 20 minutes to go. Plus, there was eight added minutes. Yeah, it's it's half, probably 30 so, minutes left. So, yeah. exactly. Half hour left. So, I mean, and then when we did go 4-3 down, he brings another striker on. He's just taken the striker off half hour ago. Mm. But do you think, do you think Steve, that, that, that that's the problem? And I think he done similar against Aston Villa, didn't he? Where, you know, second half, you're behind the ball. And that, that's the frustration yeah. that is like... Like it's it's a great game of football. Both teams are getting chances. Yeah. Antonio's causing havoc. He's been having one of the best games he's had yeah. in six months. He's holding the ball up. Oh, Bowen's doing well. Kudos is doing well. Piquet and like, no, no, yeah. three three one up. Yeah. Let's let's sit back and then you invite pressure. Exactly. Why don't they go and exactly. score another one? Make it four one. Do you know that's the problem? Exactly. That that is that that is exact. You know that is what the West Ham supporters are. You know angry about. Mm. We just. Just keep it as it is. If it's not broke, don't fix it. Mm, you know what look, I mean? Yeah, I mean just, Steve. Just, just try and change it in the 89th, 90th minute. Mm-hmm. Steve, look, wait there, off. though, because I want you to listen to this. This is West Ham manager David Moyes. He said his side weren't in control despite being 3-1 up. I thought the opposite. I thought we weren't in control. We'd gone 3-1 up, uh, and I thought that they had got control. So I had to find a way of getting control back. So what we done was we... We thought we'd bring on a third midfield player to give us a little bit extra in midfield, change it around a little bit. I think Mick had played, I don't know, maybe 60, 65 minutes by then. So, uh, no, we, we we ended up looking a poor decision. But the truth is we'd done it for what we thought. We didn't want to wait till we'd gone 3-2 down before we made the decision. We thought we were we were under the cosh at that time and, uh, and we certainly were because they'd missed a couple of chances before the poor decision on the penalty kick on the second one. I mean, that right there sums up David Moyes. He says 3-2 down. What do you mean? You're winning. You're, you're winning. We have to come back to you, though, because there's a goal at Villa Park. In Stringer. Diaby with a ripper into the back of the net. It's Villa 1, Wolves nil in the 36th minute. A set piece, and it comes out to Diaby for his eighth of the season, and he just lashes it into the top corner. Goalkeeper Saar has got no chance whatsoever. It's a cracking finish. He had one of those second or two just to get ready for it did Diaby as he ripped it into the back of the net it was a well worked set piece whipped into the the left wing cross comes in and it falls to Diaby he just gets a second left foot into the top corner and Villa have got to say as much as it breaks my heart Gabby are deserving of their lead 36 gone Villa 1 Wolves nil. yeah good goal well worked set piece brilliant finish 1-0 to the Villa. We get back to... How am you? How am you, Wolverhampton? How am you? <laughs> get in there, Jamie! Oh, here we go. Come on, the Can't army. Do for another Smash hour. Smash in, uh, Wolverhampton let's... Wanderers. <laughs> <laughs> let's go back to Steve, though, the West Ham fan. Look, you've heard David Moyes there speaking, and yeah. it's just so... Mm. Such a negative decision in my head. Yeah. And look, he says it, it looks is. like it now I mean, it's a bad it, one, but it, 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 can't get yeah. them wrong. It, it's not the first time it's been negative this season, to be honest, guys. I mean, you know, I mean, we're everywhere, Moyes in, Moyes out. I mean, I, I really don't know. He's done, he's done a fantastic job for us. Let's not, let's not dispute that. He's done brilliantly for us. But I really can't see us moving on any further. And um, if we can talk about that second penalty, mm-hmm. can we talk about the second penalty? I mean, harsh. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Oh, mate. I mean, Phillips, I mean, obviously he hasn't had a great time since mm. he started his West Ham career, let's face it. But, I mean, we can't blame Phillips for that, can we? I mean, he's, no, no. he's, he's, looking, he's looking up the pitch. He's, he's got his leg back to clear the ball away. A Newcastle player has wrapped his leg around the front 
and Phillips has kicked his leg rather than the ball. But you see, you see that though, Steve. I've seen a few of them happen this season. I think one might have been was it um, Newcastle player. Um, I think Shara was it Fernandez maybe. It's the way the game's gone now. I agree, it shouldn't be a penalty, but yeah, it's nah. the way the game's gone now. But Calvin Phillips for me looks so low on confidence that I actually feel sorry for him now because oh, no. he, he comes yeah, on, he that happens, yeah, yeah. you can see his face, and then he's not really getting on the ball as he's meant to. He's Calvin Phillips, we know, nah. and then the winner for him, Harvey Barnes, he turns him too easy, whips it in the corner, and he after Barnes turns him. He just walks. It's like he's, he's oh, no. he must be oh, so no, but, low on confidence. It's hard. But, but, yeah, but that that decision again. If that was in the middle of the pitch and uh, a guy tried to kick the ball up the field and mm. uh, an opposing it, it player coming coming from behind, then surely that's a free kick to. Yeah, free kick to West Ham, isn't it? Yeah, Surely. Yeah, yeah. It's just another shocking decision. Both of them. I yeah, thought. I thought the shocking. first one was shocking absolutely as well. I don't shocking. think the first one's a penalty. Yeah. But no, absolutely, I agree with you guys. I you, agree with you. You walk yeah. away from that game and you're thinking, have we? Have we lost? Have we got beat there? You know, like three one up away from home. It's but an the, but Jamie, unbelievable performance, yeah. and West Ham fans but walk away going, we've got beat. They're so exciting to watch, though. You like got Bowie and Cuda, Spiketa, Antonio, yeah. and you're like, how have we lost that game? Is it? Is it a negative? Tactics from a manager. Mm. Would another manager who that group of players think, no, let's let's carry on. We're not bothered about Newcastle, St James's Park. Let's go and get four one, five one. They've got to push on. We're going to hit them more on the counter attack with Antonio, mm. and then the negativity costs you. Do you think David Moyes is maybe out of a job in the summer? Ooh. There's a sign new contract yet. The problem is, is like they're still in Europa League. See, see, like, you're know. contradicting still, yourself. I know this that, is, this is how seven. West Ham fans are. No, right but, now. no but, but obviously what I'm trying to say is that, like, look how well they're doing. Yeah, I know. Could the right manager take them to where Villa are looking to go to now? Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? With yeah. the group of players they've got. Yeah. Could a Uno you know, Emery sort of manager, similar, yeah. do better with them? Yeah. Are they even underperforming this season with the quality that they've got? Because they're frightening going mm. forward. I know. They got some really good players. Yep. They really have. Uh, West Ham fans, obviously, I want to hear from you on that. On AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app, and on your smart speaker.